Okay, guys, go. Put us at your pen at what'd you say about 5 30 there at the pen? Yeah, even dude, if you're there at 5 45, that gets us to the field by 6 15. That's an hour and five minutes. I got all the blinds set up. All we gotta do is so a bunch of them have grass on them. We just gotta spend 15 minutes touching them all up and throw out. Okay. It's gonna be so windy. I don't want to put out a huge spread. Um, won't be, we just won't be able to cover it all. I think I'll just put out probably two bags at that piece of those and call it good. And then Sweet. a couple spinners, call it good. Heck yeah. Well, that sounds awesome, man. Well, I guess we're going to go downstairs and grab some food and then probably turn in yeah. pretty early. Yeah, but just be at that pin at 545, um, and then uh, Vegas is there at 615. We should be in good shape. Excellent. Sounds good, man. Looking forward to it. All right, bro. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you, buddy. Yeah. See you. That's good. That's exciting. Sounds like we've... Uh, Got a good one lined up tomorrow. It sounds like it's pretty close to the roost and it's a great day to hunt it because the wind is blowing really, really hard the opposite direction. So um, it should be fun. Just playing with the camera a little bit. I think I'm dialed in. <laughs> See if Jordy can get up there on the lefty and let him have it. Uh, yeah, it's gonna be good. Let's go get some food. Now it's to the point though, we're running so wide open and so easy to get around everywhere. I'm like, screw it, now I don't want any of it. I was hoping we'd get a couple inches because it was flooded like all summer. Like all these lowlands had water and ducks. Like we were sitting prime for like teal visions, gadwalls everywhere. And we just, it, everything's drying up so fast that all we've got is mallards, which is fine. But they're going to get tough at some point if we don't get a front. Right. It was a uh, pre hunt interviews today. I'm going to have to have people screaming. So uh, we're here. Uh... <laughs> I'd like to stay off that water just a little bit more, but I think if we go in that gnarly corn right there with the layouts and we're just kind of face it north, northeast, we should be in good shape. Sounds like a plan to Yeah, be. we'll get some blinds. The blinds are set up, we just gotta double them, so. Got a little combine cornfield. We've got about 300 honkers, five, six hundred ducks coming really close, but we got a big wind, so we've been kind of waiting for a good south wind to hunt it. Um, they're roosting about 500 yards south of us, obviously, with the we got a big wind this morning. It's blowing 20, 25 sustained, so they won't hear us shooting. We'll be shooting straight away from them. Um, we're not going to put out a huge spread today with that big wind, um, give them less of a chance to skirt us, land long, do funny things. We're going to try and keep it a little tighter. 
and uh, try and get them right uh, right out front. Should be pretty good. They haven't been hunted. A um, bunch of ducks, bunch of geese. So we'll see what happens. Let's just kind of cover the back of the blinds with them and then okay. just kind of loose up that way a little bit, loose down this way and try and shoot them in this okay. low cut corn right here. So. Guys. Look, uh, look at this rope that uh, yeah. Ben's rocking. Sheesh. That's a lot of locals. That's impressive. A lot of, lot of late season I like locals. It. I like it. Wow. Ben, what's your dog's name? Pooch. Pooch? Pooch. Like Turner and Hooch? Already snacking on You bet, dude. We got it all set up. Getting ready to climb in the blind. Getting a little pre hunt snack. Hey, this is a good time for a question. What is your go-to blind snack? I've got some beef jerky in the bag, maybe for later. Cheese, it's uh, not usually a staple in the lineup, but they were calling my name in the gas station. The gas station actually was crazy yesterday. They had gushers and fruit by the foot in a and a mega pack that were absolutely calling my name. And uh, boy, it was hard to walk away from them. So anyway, I want the extra toasted cheese. It's but you guys let us know in the comments. What's your uh, blind snack? You already know what it's about. We need some free decoys, let us know. We're all set up, ready to roll, We're about to climb the blinds. Should be a lot of fun. Big time win. We gotta shoot straight, because after that first shot, they're gonna drop them wings and they're gonna get out of here quick. So, uh, about go time. so sick from back there. I'm gonna tell you in that wind you pretty much get one <laughs> one good shot when they're that close too but um, we talk about getting out in a hurry but boy those did it good there was a lot of hints in that group um, you know, there was plenty block of wind plenty green now where you can you can start picking them out um, but yeah that was that was sweet they were right on we're top of us guys. They're moving. Yeah, we'll get moving. Get get some more because they're they're eating it up.
So I've got some reps in and now we've put Jordan up in the blind and uh, I gave him the GoPro to strap on. So we'll see what he can do with them. They are doing it nice and tight. I mean, we are shooting them close. They're crawling in that wind. And now that the sun's getting up, they're, uh, they're starting to eat it up. So we'll see what we can do with them. Jordan. What? You locked in? When am I not? You got your game face on? Always. <laughs> sideways we're trying to get them just perfect but got a good little pile going and the sun's getting high so we'll, we'll be in good shape nice what do you nice. think about it buddy having fun Today, super windy, really trashy field. Uh, he has a bad tendency when he gets into big stock rows, like he wants to run instead of back, kind of cross row. But he got it. It took a little, it took about 85 whistles. So, all you dog trainers, don't judge me, because I don't care. <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna put a bow on it this morning. Uh, we got about half a limit. Uh, shot a bunch of honkers. We're going to uh, blowing too hard now. They're not flying real good. Not working very well. Um, it's gonna lay down a little bit tonight. We got good sun and still a good wind, just not so much. So we're gonna come back tonight and finish them up.
Yo, how we looking from this morning? Dude, it's it's pretty good. Let's see it. Ugh. I mean, you just cranked that one. Let's see what we got. Check out this up close. Getting that midday work in. Up close, personal. Ooh. Oh, 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 oh. Look. Ooh. You cranked that green head. Yeah, yeah, we'll clean them up. Got a few left to kill this afternoon. Yeah. Getting a little midday work session. Oh, yeah. Should be good. Gonna head back out this afternoon. It's a no nap squad, bro. We don't take naps. Nah. No caffeine. naps allowed, dog. <laughs> <laughs> naps. Feel like I'm about what to have that? a heart attack every day, but <laughs> hey, it's what you gotta do. All right. <laughs> so we are back to the field for our afternoon hunt. We thought the wind was going to lay down a little bit, and I think it's actually about 10 miles an hour stronger. Dude, uh, this is crazy. It's blowing, like, it bro. Orkin. Um, we'll do the best we can with the audio. Uh, you guys bear with us. But, uh, again, like this morning, we're going to have to be efficient with our shots because uh, they're going to be in and out in a hurry. You know, a lot of people, they think when you just got these monster winds, everything's just going to be easy and great, and they're just going to coast right in. And a lot of times it just blows them side to side and then when they get blown over you it's really hard to get them to hook back sometimes in a wind that's 30 35 miles an hour um you know the the hope is that they'll get out front and you can get them down in that first pass but man a lot of times like this morning if they get past you, you lose them and you don't get another crack at them uh, but we're hopeful this afternoon uh, they didn't get to feed much this morning so hopefully they'll come out hungry and uh give us a nice nice shot right out front hydrated by this wind oh, we're excited it's uh that wind has not laid down a, a lick but it's uh about 440 hopefully they'll start kicking around uh, you know maybe five or a little after we'll see it's you know bright sunny day but the wind is blowing really really hard so uh, we're optimistic we're gonna rip into a few bunches this afternoon we'll see what we can do with them go guys Drake heavy this morning, so having a few hens come off the bat, that's fine. Levi joined us this afternoon. I think you got one there. Your first shot, somebody's first shot from the right side crunched one. Tried. <laughs> Get him, guys. Nice. Hoop. Good shoot, boys. Nice job, shoot fellas. Good hand. shoot. I, I didn't even shoot. Heck oh, yeah. I, I just I was trying to beat whoever to the hand. Like, Good stuff, man. Liam. 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 Fetch him up, please. Back. Go 
by go ahead you mean butt shoot one? <laughs> Still got him. I, I'm not gonna not I'm not gonna not shoot him all. You got him though. Oh you could have taken that one. That was just good boy, come on buddy. Running out of daylight here, um, but we've been chipping away at them this afternoon. It's been a lot of fun. Really, really warm. Still really windy. Um, just cranked another green head right there, but we are we're losing our light quick. Uh, but it's it's been a, just a great day, like all all around great day. This morning was awesome. Had a good uh, breakfast, and uh, we've had a good afternoon. They're fighting that wind, but uh, it's been a lot of fun here. Laying in the corn stalks. We might see if we can, you know, make the make the most of this little bit of time left. But that might be all she wrote for this uh, this hunt. Go hey, check out this filming setup. I'm rocking just <laughs> laying back. <laughs> well, it was good. Uh, a little bit too much wind today, but we had a good day. We were a handful short on our ducks and killed ten honkers and. Made the most of it, 71 degrees, and had a great day, had a lot of fun. They were challenging in that wind. They'd, first shot, they'd be out of there pretty quick, but we did good, had fun. Great hunt, man. That was a lot of fun. Nice little combo there. Uh, good time. Ben, Fuyan, great host, man. What a cool guy. We had a lot of fun, and we're looking forward to uh, spending another day in the blind with him tomorrow. We hope you all enjoyed this, and we'll see you on the next one. God bless you.